At 18 months old, Alfie Phillips had barely taken his first steps. His mother, seen in this video watching over him, has now been sentenced for his murder. Sean Hedges and her former boyfriend, Jack Benham, unleashed a drug and alcohol fueled night of violence and extreme brutality on little Alfie during lockdown in November 2020. He suffered more than 50 injuries, including fractured ribs and arms, with traces of cocaine found in his body. The cumulative effects of these vicious and brutal assaults resulted in his death. It must have taken some considerable time to inflict these injuries on Alfie, and the pain and fear that he must have suffered is almost unimaginable. It's 2.33. And yet, when both were arrested the morning after the attack, they pleaded their innocence. During the nine-week trial, they blamed each other. But jurors decided both were complicit. During sentencing, the court heard that Alfie had suffered from violent, aggressive discipline that had become a furious, protracted attack. The court also heard that both Benham and Hedges had been involved, encouraging and assisting each other in taking Alfie's life. And to process in it. Alfie's father, um, Sam Phillips, listened to the evidence in court in horror. I couldn't be there to stop him or try and help him, and that's what does hurt the most. No. He was completely unaware of what his son had been subjected to. He was the little, sweetest, blonde-headed, blue-eyed little boy you could imagine. Up to no good all the time, being Alfie, but he was a little boy growing up. He was horrific, and it's been a long, lengthy trial, and it's taken a long time. But we're here now. Alfie can finally be free. But his killers will not. Benham has been sentenced for a minimum term of 23 years and Hedges for at least 19. The pair deprived Alfie of protection and love. Instead, his life with them was filled with unfathomable pain, for which they will now face a lifetime behind bars. Ashton Harinag, Sky News, in Maidstone.